welcome back everyone so i have been using windows 10 on my old laptop from a long time i did not had any problem but now it's really working slow and there is a lot of lagging problem so today i will be upgrading this windows 10 to atlas os windows 10 and it will be surely improving the performance and i will be showing you each and everything in front of you but before that you can see the process count of my windows 10 is around 145 and i'm not using any kind of application right now the thread count is around 1500 and the handle is around 52000 and the total ram that i'm using is around 4 gigabyte all right so now let's see that how exactly you have to upgrade for that bring up any of your favorite browser then you will have to come to this website a modification of windows designed for gamers and here you have to download both this file of atlas playbook and ame wizard so click on them one by one and once the files are being downloaded open the downloaded folder okay now here first you have to extract atlas playbook so right click on it click on extract all click on extract once extracted you will be getting disable automatic driver installation just make a double click on it click on run click on yes yes and okay and once it's been done now you can close it next you have to look for ame wizard beta right click on it click on extract all click on extract once extracted you have to double click on ame wizard beta dot exe just make a double click on it click on yes and the ame wizard beta dashboard will be up now here on the left hand side you have to click on drag dot apbx file just click on it now you will have to locate to the place where you have downloaded the ame wizard beta then you have to look for atlas playbook double click on it and here you will find atlas playbook dot apbx file select it click on open once selected now it says run action so you will have to click on it click on open windows security and here you have to disable the real-time protection cloud delivered protection and the automatic sample submission and don't worry once the installation is complete you can re-enable them back once disable go back again it will be checking for the windows security and then finally it will say windows security is being disabled so now you can close this box and then you have to click on next now it will be analyzing the installation file so you will have to wait and it says the system meet all requirement for this playbook click on next click on next again click on i agree and in the configuration option you have to click on select options and here you will be getting some kind of options like you can enable the windows defender security or you can disable it i will keep it to enable but if you want to disable the windows security then you can disable it then you have to click on next default windows mitigation i will keep this selected click on next disable core isolation so yes i will disable it disable the printing bluetooth power saving if you don't use the printing or the bluetooth service then you can just disable them click on next disable hibernation automatic update remove snipping tool application all right so if you want to make your windows more lighter and if you really don't need these options then you can just disable them all click on next remove microsoft edge install a browser so click on next and now it will ask you that which browser exactly you want to install so i will go with chrome i will select it click on ok click on next so the installation process will now be started so you will have to relax now wait for some time until the installation is being completed Okay, so bingo now you can see that our windows 10 has been successfully upgraded to atlas os windows 10 and you can see this kind of wallpaper they provide at the background and if you make a right click on the desktop so this kind of context menu we get now let's see the major difference now it's working much smoother if i bring up anything so it's working much faster and even it has been converted in the dark mode so that's another interesting point all right so now let's see what kind of utilization what kind of consumption is being done so let me bring up the task manager let's go in the performance cpu 
okay so now you can see that that's a huge difference now earlier the process count was around 140 now it's been reduced to around 70 the thread was around 14 to 1500 now it's been around 900 the handle count that was around i guess 50000 now it's came to 28000 the utilization of the cpu you can see 1% 2% and just because of this only now i will be having the faster performance even if i have the 2 gigabyte of ram and even it has installed the google chrome browser and removed the microsoft edge so i'm ready to go and enjoy the browser now and even there will not be any kind of data loss so even if you upgrade from windows 10 to atlas 10 or windows 11 to atlas os then you will not be losing any of your data and you can see that all the file exists here nothing has been deleted so that's all guys for today and my honest review is that you should go ahead and upgrade to atlas os it's really safe, fastest and the lightweighted operating system for the old machine and laptop. Hopefully you enjoyed the video guys. If yes, do not forget to like and subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.